Welcome to Tackle Fanatics TV. Welcome to uh, Linear Fisheries. Uh, you join me in session on Braze Nose 2. And what more can I say about the Linear Fisheries complex? You know, real mix of fishing, loads of lakes, loads of opportunities, and loads of, uh, of big fish. Now, when it comes to day ticket fishing, we really want to identify tactics that are going to get us bites um, and keep the bites coming. Now, one method that I really advocate, not just for linear fisheries, and this is for you know, day ticket fishing um, all across the country at any time of year, and that is fishing with solid PVA bags. Now, it's something that I've been doing for, for many years, caught absolutely stacks of fish using a, just a simple solid bag, and it really has accounted for, for fish of all sizes. So, um, I say it's dead simple. I think we need to take a little bit more detail in what actually goes into uh, the rig, and the bait and the actual solid bag itself. Now, there's a reason why I go for such compact, small little uh, rocket sized uh, solid bags. Uh, first of all, they cast like an absolute dream. They literally do go out like an arrow or even like a lead, you know, they're, they're absolutely perfect. Uh, the other side of things, they're just a nice morsel or mouthful for, uh, for any browsing carp. You'd be surprised at how much bait is actually uh, stored in one of these. And best of all, they're really easy to tie up. Right then, onto the mix, that's where it gets important. First ingredient, spot and PVA pellet mix. Loads of different size pellets in this mix, absolutely perfect, and that actually makes uh, the basis of the first part of the mix. Next into the mix goes some four mil essential cell response pellets, which give off you know, a really, really strong food signal. Okay, next into the mix is some essential cell stick and bag mix. Now this is a really fine powder, uh, this will help to bind the mix all together, especially when it's combined with some essential cell uh, stick mix liquid. And what this liquid actually does, it helps to bind everything together. I really like a stodgy mix so that you can really compress the bag mix together. Really, really important additive. And what's more, this particular liquid, once the solid bag has been cast out onto your spot on the lake bed, delivers a massive flavour trail all the way through the water column. Okay, well here we have the finished mix. This has been uh, carefully blended, all stirred in just to make sure all the essential cell liquid is evenly uh, deposited throughout the whole mix. And that's what it looks like. It looks absolutely fantastic. Loads of different food part particle sizes, uh, loads of colour and absolutely bags of attraction. All we need to do now is get it in the solid bag. In terms of actually loading up the solid bags, they can be a little bit fiddly to get them this tight, small and compact, but with practice, it does, it does come easier. So in terms of what I actually do myself, um, I drop the, uh, the hook into the bottom of the bag and just hook it through the bottom. So it actually secures the hook in the bottom of the bag. And then it's a case of just adding a little bit of mix with a scoop just to, uh, to fill the bottom of the, uh, the solid bag. Then once you've done that, just keep adding the, the mix and then you can actually drop your lead in. Again, just keep adding a little bit of mix. I would say when you get to about half full, then it's time to start actually compressing the bag. And uh, the way I do this, literally, I just, uh, I'll bang it against my leg. And what it does, it forces all the mix down and it starts to compact. And that's where you find that the mix of particle sizes, uh, the stick mix and the liquid, it will start to, uh, to bond together. So it's almost like a little method ball. And I just keep adding the mix uh, until I've covered the top of the lead. And then you'll get the, uh, the stem of the lead, whether it's a, uh, a shock leader sleeve or the actual hard stem poking out the top of the bag. Now, once it's fully compacted, then it's uh, a case of just tying it off with uh, some solid PVA tape. So what I'll do, I'll twist it round, add the tape, tie it off once, tie it off twice, and then I start to just trim down the, uh, the sort of the tag end of the bag, and then I'll lick it and then just twist it round. The final step, literally just to fold in the corner. So literally press the mix in just to kind of square it off and then just lick, fold, and then repeat on the other side and it's job done. So there we go. Loop to loop, connected, and ready to be cast out into the pond. You've been tuned in to TFTV. Tackle Fanatic stock an extensive range of tackle and bait from all the leading manufacturers. To check it out, go to www.tacklefanatic.co.uk. Remember Tackle Fanatics also offer finance to make your tackle purchase more affordable. Tight lines and wet nets from everybody at TFTV.